Hello, everybody. Welcome to another edition of Today in History. Today is May 22nd, 2023. And uh, here are some interesting events that occurred uh, today in history. First off, in 1865, U.S. rebel chief tracked down. In the aftermath of the U.S. Civil War, Jefferson Davis, the fugitive president of the defeated Confederate States, was caught today by Union Cavalry Colonel Benjamin Pritchard in Irwinville, Georgia. He was disguised as a woman. There is the handsome reward of, of $100,000 for his capture to collect. President Andrew Johnson has publicly accused Davis of complicity in the assassination of President Lincoln. Davis fled from Virginia last month as the Confederacy collapsed with the intention of organizing a government in exile. He is now awaiting indictment in prison at Fort Monroe. Also today in 1908, uh, Wright's patent flying machine. That's right, the Wright brothers. Uh, 1908, Wilbur and Orville Wright patented their first flying machine today, four years after their historic first powered flight at Kitty Hawk in North Carolina. I've been there, by the way. That day, the Flyer One or Flyer One made four flights, the longest lasting a minute and covering 852 feet or 259 meters. Today, they still use the same machine, very much improved, to make flights uh, of 40 minutes traveling up to 25 miles, or 40 kilometers, at altitudes of 150 feet or more. Strangely, the brothers are hardly known in America, except for a few hundred enthusiasts. But now their pioneering work is starting to bear fruit. Last year, the U.S. Army Signal Corps contracted the rights to build a two-man aircraft capable of flying 125 miles an hour. And later this year, the brothers are to take their aircraft on tour in France, hence today's patent. Also today in 1972, uh, President Nixon visited the USSR, the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics. And finally, we have some birthdays today. Uh, the first birthday we have today is Harvey Milk, who is a civil rights activist. He, he was born on this day in 1930 and was assassinated in 1978 at the age of only 48. And the other birthday we have today is Julian Edelman, who is 37 today. Former NFL wide receiver, played 12 seasons his entire career with the New England Patriots. That's all for today in history. Thank you for watching. Please remember to like the video, share it with your friends, comment down below, and please subscribe. I'll see you next time.